and we are just playing around with names. This does not mean that ACL is actually interacting with the uh, MVC structure. We are creating all of these naming schemes by ourselves. Uh, so, one more thing I want to guess to view is errors and um, we don't want to do this in a production environment at all but uh, I want to see all the errors I am having while I'm developing this thing. Okay, and as before, we don't want users to play around with the login. We don't want anybody logging in twice. So we're going to deny users from logging in. Okay. So uh, we are on users already, so let's um, go ahead and combine the rest of the privileges to the resources. We're going to allow users to visit the index page, which happens to be a part of the default index. That's the resource here, default index. And we are going to allow the user to perform index action on the default index privilege. Um, same thing goes for default authentication logout and library books. And here's the interesting part. Uh, there is a number of things that the users can do on library books. And if that's the case, we are going to put in the array of the allowed um, things or actions. I don't really want to use the same words that I used to describe the MVC or else everybody gets confused again. And um, since the admin inherits from the users back up here when we created the roles, um, all of these are automatically applied to the admins group. So all I have to do for admins is to allow him the admin book. And he can do quite a number of things with that. He can index the books, he can add them, he can edit them and he can delete them. Alright, so I forgot all my semicolons. Oops, no, 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 you don't want semicolons there. But you do want one there. Okay, good. So, with the ACL structure updated, we need to adjust our navigation XML as well to reflect that. Now, uh, we're going to first off we have to update our existing privilege uh, tags so let's get it out of the way right now the logout is a part of the default authentication and so is login uh, books are a part of library books and book is a part of admin book okay uh, the reason why I'm not doing anything to these guys is because the Z navigation inherits the permissions from the top level so if this one is not allowed this one will not display anyway so I'm not going to waste time uh, putting the resources and the privileges down here if you have something more complex, then you're going to have to do that. Okay, now, because our action does not coincide with the second level resource anymore, we are going to have to uh, explicitly write down our privilege. So, the privilege for logout is logout. Okay, if this doesn't make any sense, what we're trying to do is we're trying to translate what does logout link here translate to on our ACL table here. 
Uh, so our resource is the default authentication coming in from the default module authentication controller and our privilege comes up from the logout here so we want to have this similar structure here the resource privilege here to resource privilege here so then that means that the login is going to have uh, just login here uh, books now with the uh, library books what it is that we wanted to do we want to index it now here is a trick there is uh, the reason why I put index there even though I'm actually now visiting the index page is so that I can list it here So you don't even have to have this as one of the actions. It's just uh, a dummy uh, privilege so that I can put something in here. And I just thought index would be a, a good word to use. You can call it whatever you want here. Same goes for this one here. Privilege is going to be index as well because I just want to list it. Well, but the link is not active because I'm using the blank URI up there. So with that, the application should actually work. Okay, uh, no, it doesn't because I forgot to include all the plugins. So yeah, we got to uh, update all of this now. So the ACL should now work. Yeah, because it's a part of the default, I don't have to put in the prefix here. Uh, same goes for here. That should be now included and this is now active so i can put back the navigation acl in and let's see if that works uh, role guest not oh yeah uh, i forgot to apply the guests here if you get any errors at this point that's because the current browser cookie session uh, is not yet uh, in sync with our new privileges here uh, so just either restart your browser or refresh your cookies and you should be um, back without any errors. So let's see how it all works out now. Uh, if I log in with that to a regular user, I should be able to just list and here. Okay, there is a slight problem. I'm still looking in at login even though uh, I'm not allowed to do it. Oh yeah, that is because for some reason I put in authentication. I put, in, I put error instead of authentication there. Okay. So that in mind, yes, it's gone now. Okay, good. Uh, so we can list now, we can log out and notice how it all updates. Let's check out administrator. Okay, we, pull to the, we can see the full menu delete edit and add and there we go list okay so there we go we got our ACL and navigation updated to handle the modules